Hello and welcome to the first round of Factathlon 2024. I'm your quiz master, Chris Flaherty. Thank you for joining us back in the BCAT studio. Factathlon is Burlington High School's annual quiz show tournament where teams of three compete in a double elimination bracket tournament. Let's meet our first two teams today. On the red side of our stage, we have the on-brand Factonauts. Welcome, guys. Please introduce yourselves to the audience. I'm Zach Titus. I'm Cecilia. I'm Jada Bazzara. And on the blue side of our stage, we have the Nana Society. Welcome. Mm -hmm. Please introduce yourselves. I'm Nora Clarito. I'm Nathan Previtt. I'm Amelia Nagel. Awesome. Good luck, teams. And just a quick overview of the rules for you guys and the folks at home. Uh, I'll ask the questions. Uh, good rule of thumb, wait until you hear the very end of the question to buzz in. Please do not buzz in, or please do not answer until I acknowledge that your buzzer is the one that is lit up. Uh, if you get the question right, you get a point. If you get it wrong, you lose a point, and your opponents have a chance to steal. Sound good? All right. I'm going to turn our buzzers on. Oh, they're already on. Perfect. We're one step ahead of the game. And I will start our 15-minute timer. And as always with Factathlon, we start with a current events question. Sports, short answer. What two teams played in the recent Super Bowl? Nana Society. The Chiefs and the 49ers. That is correct. Point for the Nana Society. Current events, multiple choice. Which major credit card company is purchasing Discover? The merger will result in the largest credit card lender in the country. Is it A, Bank of America, B, Dossian Bank, C, Capital One, or D, New England Credit? Fact or not? Bank of America. That is incorrect. Do we have to answer? You do not have to answer. Wait, is it? Do you be confident on it? I think it's Capital One. Can I just answer that? Capital One. Capital One is correct. Yes, that's what I thought. <laughs> Current events, multiple choice. The three biggest what in New England plan to make improvements under a one billion federal plan? A, public universities, B, conference centers, C, airports, or D, historic landmarks? Three biggest what? All right, we're going to move on. The answer is airports. Mm -hmm. okay. <laughs> Math short answer. Solve the problem. Five x equals one hundred. Nana Society. Um, x equals twenty. X does equal twenty. Yes. Sir. Point for the Nana Society. U.S. history, multiple choice. Pick the traitor to the American colonists. A, George Washington, B, Nathan Hale, C, Benedict Arnold, or D, Thomas Gage. Factonauts. C, oh. oh. <laughs> Factonauts. Benedict Arnold is correct. I forgot what our name was, sorry. <laughs> you were kind of with Benedict Arnold right there. <laughs> yeah, my bad, guys. Sign up. U.S. history, put the following events in chronological order. The Sugar Act, the Boston Massacre, the start of the Revolutionary War, and the French and Indian War. Fact or not? French and Indian War, uh, Sugar Act, uh, Boston Massacre, and the start of the um, Revolutionary War. That is correct. Point for the fact or not. Music, multiple choice. Beyonce's new country chart topper gives a nod to what state? A. Cali Texas. Texas is correct. Yes, that's what I was going to say. Point for the Nana Society. Art, multiple choice. What is the enormous underground army of clay statues found in China known as? Oh, Nana wait. Is it the Forbidden City? It is incorrect. Okay. Fact or not, okay. you have a chance. You were right there. We'll pass. It was C, the Terracotta Warriors. I knew that. Pop culture logos, short answer. What does the Lego logo look like? Fact or not? So it's a red cube, then there's the word Lego written in white as a black border, I think. That is correct. <laughs> Point for the fact or not. TV shows, short answer. Wait, did they get the Terracotta Warriors? 
No. They did not. Yeah, no one got a point on the Terracotta Warriors question. All right. TV shows, short answer. Can you finish the end of the Scooby-Doo theme song that starts? I'm not singing it. I'm just going to do spoken word. scooby dooby doo here are Nana Society. Where are you? This is incorrect. Here are you. I know. I don't know why it parts my mind. Fact and us. I can finish the thing if you'd like. Oh, please. Yeah. All right. Scooby Dooby Doo, here are you. You're ready and you're willing. If we can count on you, Scooby Doo, I know blank. I know this. Do you know it? I know it. I don't watch Scooby Doo. Okay, I'll give you guys 10 seconds. Oh my god. I'm nervous. I'm nervous. Okay, do we know what we should just pass? Okay, yeah, it's fine. Yeah, we're passing. I know we'll catch that villain. I want to know what I'm Sorry. Science and astronomy, short answer. Name the fourth planet from the sun. Factonauts. Mars. Mars is correct. Point for the Factonauts. It's not <laughs> Animals, multiple choice. Name the species of bird that has a tongue so long it wraps around the back of its skull when not in use, protecting its brain while it taps into trees. Ostrich, lark, parrot, or woodpecker? What woodpecker? Nana Society? Woodpecker? Woodpecker is correct. I have okay, no idea society. woodpeckers did that. <laughs> Point for the Nana Society. Geography. Name four of the 12 countries in South America. Fact or not? Uh, Brazil, Ecuador, Paraguay, Uruguay, uh, Argentina. I only needed four. Oh. You, you don't get extra points. <laughs> okay. But good job. U.S. history. Finish this sentence. Four score and seven years ago, our fathers brought forth on this continent a new nation conceived in liberty and dedicated to the proposition that what? Fact or not? All men are queer. All, no, all, yeah, all men are queer equal or something. That is correct. From Abraham Lincoln's Gettysburg Address. Point for the fact or not. Math, multiple choice. What is the name of a triangle with no congruent sides? Nana Society. Scalene. Scalene, Scalene is correct. Point for the Nana Society. Geography, multiple choice. Where is Patagonia? Nana Society. Argentina. Argentina is correct. Point for the Nana Society. Science and anatomy, multiple choice. Your heart is nestled in your chest between the two halves of what other organ? The lungs. Lungs is correct. I need to just mm -hmm. that. Sports, multiple choice. Which of these is the name for the backyard sport where bean bags are tossed? Fact or not? Cornhole. Cornhole is correct. <laughs> Pop culture logo, short answer. What does the app store app icon look like? Nana Society. Um, it's a blue square with uh, two tools. And Intersecting. Yes, that is correct. <laughs> <laughs> TV shows, short answer. Can you sing or finish the rest of this show's theme song? You guys are killing me here. Sunny day, sweeping the clouds away, on my way to where the air is sweet, can you tell me how to get to Sesame Street? That is correct. <laughs> <laughs> TV shows, multiple choice. Due to high ratings, this is Nickelodeon's longest running live action television series and features Captain Man, Schwaz, Nana Society. Henry Danger. Henry Danger is correct. It ran from July 2014 to March 2021 with 121 episodes. Justice for Victorious. Ooh. Childhood memories, short answer. <laughs> Who sat on a tuffet eating curds and whey? What? Oh! Nana Society. Little Miss Muffet. That is correct. <laughs> <laughs> Famous phrases in movies. Complete this sentence from Harry Potter. I solemnly swear I am... Fact and not. Up to no good. No, that is that's correct. My oh. That's my favorite. Why did you bring it? <laughs> People, short answer. Who designed a system of writing and printing for the blind that involves dashes and dots and named it after himself? I 
<laughs> Writing and printing for the blind involved dashes and dots and named it after himself. All right, the answer is Braille. Just Braille. Oh, just, Braille. Braille. <laughs> just Braille. <laughs> just Braille. Just Braille. Just Braille. Lewis Braille. It's time for some redemption. Food, multiple choice. What is another name for bubble tea? Fact or not? Boba. Boba is oh, correct. No. Hey, I'm a <laughs> Movies and musicals, multiple choice. In Beauty and the Beast, what was the name of Mrs. Potts' youngest son? Fact or not? Chip. That is correct. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Math, multiple choice. How many degrees do all angles within a triangle add up to? 180. 180 is correct. Point for the Nana Society. Short answer, mu uh, music short answer. What was the name of Taylor Swift's most recent tour? Facts it not. I <laughs> that I know this, but the answer is the Eras. Oh my god, how did we know? Don't be ashamed. <laughs> Don't be ashamed. <laughs> Eras tour is correct. We wouldn't, we wouldn't have been ashamed. <laughs> Religion, Christian holidays, multiple choice. What is the first day of Lent, the seventh Wednesday before Easter? Fact and not. Ash Wednesday. Ash Wednesday is correct. Okay, I know this and I'm just the button. Local, short answer, multiple, no, I'm sorry, local, multiple choice. Burlington is part of the Middlesex League. Which member school's mascot is the Wildcats? Wilmington. Wilmington is correct. You need to start clicking faster. Local sports, multiple choice. In 2026, Gillette Stadium will host which of these major sporting events? A, the Super Bowl, B, the World Series. Fact or not? The World Cup. The World Cup is correct. Sports slash basketball slash spelling. Here we go. <laughs> Spell the first name of the new superstar Boston Celtics starter formerly with the Milwaukee Bucks. Hint, his last name is a holiday. An extra hint, his first name is Drew. <laughs> Fact or not? D-R-E-W. That is oh, it. Oh, oh, yeah, it's not. Nope, that's incorrect. Oh, yeah. Sorry, Zach. Yeah. You guys have a chance if you want. It's a holiday? It's a holiday. His like last name is a holiday, Drew. but I Wait, need his first name. I don't even know how to spell Drew. Because it's not spelled the normal way. All right, let's just skip it. Cause let's just skip it. It's uh, J-R-U-E. What is that? I don't even know his last oh, name. Okay. So if any Celtics fans want to write into the show. Uh, Volleyball, multiple choice. Which is permitted in volleyball? A, two consecutive touches. Two consecutive touches. That is incorrect. You can't touch it two times. Yeah. Would you like to hear the rest of the question? <laughs> <laughs> Which is permitted in volleyball? A, two consecutive touches of the ball by the same person. B, touching of the ball by any part of the body. C, touching the ball out of bounds. Or D, rebounding the ball off the floor. Can't be. Touching of the ball by any part of the body. I don't think you can kick it, so yeah. C? C is correct. Touching the ball out yeah. of bounds. Uh, I'm out of questions. Uh, we still have some time left on the clock, so Miss Smith is coming in to give me some more questions. Thank you very much. You didn't see those? Sports, short answer. In the 2024 Super Bowl, much publicity was given to Taylor and Travis. Kelsey. Why? <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why? 54 seconds. <laughs> that is incorrect. <laughs> okay, short answer. Do you guys want it? Yeah, I want to hear the All rest right. of it. In the 2024 Super Bowl, much publicity was given to Taylor and Travis. What are the full names of this popular couple? You don't have to bust in, but oh, go ahead. Okay. Uh, Taylor Swift and Travis Kelsey. There we go. No, I'm not You call yourself Swifties? Oh. Religion, multiple choice. <laughs> what is the annual Jewish feast commemorating the exodus of the Jews from Egypt? Nana Society. Passover. Passover is correct. <laughs> local sports, short answer. Name all five of the local professional sports teams. 
back to notes. Uh, the Bruins, the Celtics, the uh, Patriots, um, the Red Sox, and the Revolution. That is correct. Point for the fact or not. Music. Multiple choice. What Russian composer composed the musical scores for the ballets The Nutcracker, Sleeping Beauty, and Swan Lake? Is it A, Stravinsky, B, Bach, C, Tchaikovsky, or C is correct. Point for the Nana Society. And just in time for our last question, food, multiple choice. What is the super fruit puree used in popular fruit bowls? A, Nana Society. Acai. Acai is correct. <laughs> we only got 20 seconds left on the clock, so I think we can wrap it up there. Uh, and we have the Factonauts at 16 and the Nana Society at 11. So the Factonauts take home the win. But this is double elimination, so you guys still have a chance to fight your way to the championship and face these guys again. And there's our timer. And don't go too far because round two is coming up right next. Thanks for watching Factathlon. I've been your quizmaster, Chris Flaherty. Have a fantastic day. Mm.